How are you feeling about the 2015 Terrell Tiger football team? You know, you know, real good. We, we always say the best thing about getting spring ball done is we don't get anybody hurt. You know, I'd hate to have somebody that, that has a knee injury or to have to have surgery. We were luckily Dylan Wren injured, you know, sprained a knee, but they've told us that he won't require surgery. So that was good relief. But, uh, you know, the, the kids got better. The younger kids got better, learned our system. We were able to put on more offense and defensively because this is our second year here. And, uh, you know, we feel good coming out of spring. How about, how about the scrimmage Friday? You get a good uh, look at everybody? Yeah, I mean, I mean, real good. You know, once again, it's it's kind of a catch-22. If if the defense looks pretty too good, you, you worry about the offense. If offense looks real good, you worry about the defense. So, uh, but I thought it was a good mix on Friday, you know, that the offense looked good and the defense looked good. As far as strong points going into the summer, what do you see as the? Well, you know, I really think our running game with Wanye Tucker, I think our offensive line has improved leaps and bounds between last year. And once again, part of that is just learning, learning our system and our terminology. They really got where uh, uh, where they were picking up everybody. Even if we were bringing a blitz and crossing people, they were getting picked up. So I, I look forward to that. Second thing is is the speed on defense, running to the ball. And, and we really like what our linebackers and secondary were doing. Do you have any areas of concern? Going into well, the yeah, we still we're, we're a little bit light on numbers on the defensive line. You know, and that's what, that was one of our strong points last year. Antonio Harris, Dylan Whelan, Reggie Knight, uh, Austin Koshin, you know, we lose all those guys and we got to replace them. So that, that was part of spring too, is, is seeing who we could count on to replace them. As far as any big surprises during spring practice? Uh, spring you know, like, good thing is getting a couple guys back out, uh, getting D D Dalen Hickman back out. He, he's looking good at tackle. Uh, Trey Mingus going to help us on the defense. Uh, Lane Wadsworth came from, from baseball, is going to help us at some point. Uh, you know, and then Clayton Henderson coming back from baseball, obviously playing that quarterback really looked good. But uh, the other guys, you know, I, I hate not to mention their name, but because we, we expected them, you know, and, and knew they were going to be there and everything else. So uh, we're happy about everybody. Uh, do you have any big advice for players over the summer? Well, that's what we're going to talk to them this week about is their summer program or our summer program. And, you know, I, I tell them, guys, I know you're going to go on vacation. I want you to go on vacation. You just can't go on vacation for two whole months, you know. I mean, take a week, take a week here, a week there and everything. But if you're in town, you need to be up here because when we come back, it's going to be 100 degrees and you got to be used to it. You can't sit inside all summer in the air condition and expect to be in shape be on August 10th. As far as uh, Tiger fans go for the fall, Mike, any expectations? You know, I, I, our goal still is obviously to, uh, to get in the playoffs. That's always your goal. Um, you know, we've been really preaching uh, in off season a district championship now. It's going to be tough. I'm not saying that's easy, and I'm not saying I'm going to be disappointed if we don't. But uh, that's our expectations, and we'll see how it goes.